rotator cuff tears, both symptomatic and asymptomatic, are very, very common, affecting about 40% of the population who are 60 years or older. In addition to pain over the deltoid region, patients will usually also report loss of muscle strength combined with a reduction in range of motion. To conduct the test, the patient is in sitting or standing position so that the arms can hang relaxed along the trunk, but not quite touching it. Then both elbows are flexed to 90 degrees and then the examiner places the palms on the dorsum of the patient's hands. The patient is asked to externally rotate both shoulders against the examiner's resistance. As infraspinatus tears are usually painless, weakness in external rotation would raise suspicion that there might be a tear in the muscle and indicates a positive test.